Canon PowerShot G7X Mark II offers improvements over its predecessor, making it more comfortable for shooting while maintaining its compact size and capable performance. The G7X II is built around a 1-inch type CMOS sensor, giving it better image quality than a small sensor compact camera or a smartphone. The built-in lens is a fast f1.8 to 2.8, 24-100mm to zoom, providing a lot of reach and decent low-light capabilities in a small package. The tilting touchscreen LCD makes it easy to set up and take your shots from any angle, making it ideal for selfies or street photography. The image quality, especially color rendition, is excellent on the G7X2. Its fast burst shooting enables you to capture the action. The grip is comfortable in the hand, and the control ring around the lens can be set to smooth or clicky, making it useful for both photo and video shooting. Our criticisms of the G7X2 are a relatively disappointing battery life and slightly mushy fine details in JPEGs. Overall, the Canon G7X2 is a well-designed enthusiast compact camera that can capture good quality photos and videos. This pocketable camera is a significant improvement over its predecessor and sits near the top of its class. For more information about the Canon G7X2 and all things photographic, head to dpreview.com. The Canon EOS 5D Mark IV is an outstanding camera for photographers who demand high-quality still images, as well as filmmakers looking for pro-level video capture. It has a new 30.4 megapixel full-frame sensor, providing plenty of resolution for demanding situations from professional portraits to wildlife photography. The updated 61-point autofocus system covers up to 24% more of the frame and includes face detection. 4K DCI video ensures that the camera meets the highest standards for video quality as well. The camera's raw dynamic range has been significantly improved over previous 5D models. We also like the new touchscreen, which adds useful features such as tap to focus. Canon's dual pixel autofocus provides reliable face detection and subject tracking in live view, while delivering the most accurate and natural looking autofocus we've seen when shooting video. While the 4K video quality is excellent, the 4K recording is limited to motion JPEG format, which requires large, fast memory cards and may limit recording time. Overall, the Canon 5D Mark IV is a DSLR that will meet the needs of pros and enthusiasts who require high-quality images, excellent video, and a great user interface. For more information about the Canon EOS 5D Mark IV and all things photographic, head to dpreview.com. The Canon EOS Rebel SL2 is Canon's latest entry-level APS-C format DSLR. Featuring a 24 megapixel sensor, the SL2 can compete with several of its more expensive rivals in terms of image quality, but beats them when it comes to size and weight. Designed to be as small and light as possible, the SL2 doesn't compromise on ergonomics. A large, fully articulating rear touchscreen makes live view and movie shooting fun and easy, while a range of fully automatic and manual exposure modes are available to suit both beginner and aspiring photographers alike. The SL2 offers a fairly basic 9-point AF system in conventional viewfinder mode, but its dual-pixel autofocus in live view and video is much more versatile, making it a very capable camera for tripod-mounted photography and casual video shooting. A maximum shooting rate of 5 frames per second is useful for capturing fast-moving action. Built-in Wi-Fi with NFC and Bluetooth is available for remote control and image transfer to a smart device. Overall, the Rebel SL2 is a tiny camera with a powerful feature set that will make an ideal first DSLR for a compact camera or smartphone upgrader. For more information on the Canon EOS Rebel SL2, visit dpreview.com. <laughs>